Hello everyone, it's me once again. So today I'm going to do the unboxing of this brilliant product called Tag Heuer Connected 2020. This has been released more than a month ago and I actually bought this product from the company called Peter Jackson, a UK based jeweler and um, also a nice pen by the way. And um, the reason I bought it from Peter Jackson is because they were giving a 0% interest finance option for this product. So um, not a lot of companies were providing this. They normally provide 9.9 .9 or 12% um, interest, which I wasn't happy about. But anyway, so I got it. So um, also I want to thank overall to Danny. He has answered my calls, all my queries, and he has been prompt on answering all my emails and queries. And he even adjusted the size of my wrist as well. So thank you so much, Danny. Uh, despite this period, you have been gold. So the main reason I bought this product is because uh, this is one of my uh, most expensive watch that I have at the moment, which is the Tag Heuer Carrera um, Caliber 1887. Um, it's still in good condition after six years, but I just don't want to wear this every day. And I wanted this smartwatch option uh, as well, because I, you know, I am actually into tech gadget and so on. So I actually tried the Casio ProTech, which I thought was apparently really good. But uh, it turns out the reality was that um, it hasn't got the heart sensor monitoring. Uh, it doesn't actually have payment. But then again, I don't really need that. But it didn't have that much of the things, the functions that I wanted. So I wanted to combine all these together almost like a daily kind of um, watch and also a bit of a bling because I love the metal straps. So the, the perfect solution was this Tag Heuer Connected 2020. So let's do the unboxing. So here it goes. Okay. So let's first get the cover out. And suddenly this nice premium feel. This is what I like about Tag. It's a smartwatch. Look at that. Nice. So we got first of all the um, instructions and guarantee, um, which, oh, okay. And also the international warranty uh, card as well. And this is like a quick start guide. Ah, look at that. So Danny actually adjusted the wrist size for me, which I emailed across to him. So gave me the leftovers, which is brilliant in case my wrist gets fat. And um, this is the main case, quite chunky, but before we get into that. Okay, um, so this is the power plug, UK socket power plug, which I don't think I'll need it anyway, because I've got plenty of these sort of USB, -C. I presume it's USB-C. Um, let's take this out. This is, Ah, look at that, to clean your screens. And it also has tag logo on it as well, very premium. And um, talking about premium, one of the downside some might consider is that this is actually made in China. But it made a lot of sense. Initially I was disappointed, but then again, it's um, China has all the gadgets, don't they, in regards to wearable. So I have full trust in those products anyway. So let's look at the actual thing inside. So these are the cables, USB-C, yeah. And wow, that's the actual watch. And um, I believe, let's put this aside. This is, um, I believe the actual Let's just make it focused here. It's the platform that you connect it to your wire to connect, uh, to charge your um, smartwatch. But let's see if this thing comes out. So this is how you charge your Tag Heuer, I presume. Wow, just, okay. So there's a Tag Heuer logo on it and magnetic connections and so on. So. Um, oh, uh, before we get into that, this, after your, uh, after your uh, adjustment of wrist, if, if it's too thin, your wrist, then you could also use the alternative to put it here. But then again, this is too tiny for, anyway, 
enough said about that. So the actual watch um, would be charged with this in the back. So then the USB-C would be connected into this. Okay? Right. So let's look at the actual watch compared to the um, Carrera 1887 that I own, okay? This is 41 mil, um, the Carrera 1887, and this is 45 with a bit of a more extra bezel. Still look, looks good. And um, sapphire crystal lens, both of them. And the reason I love sapphire crystal is that I had this for more than six years. It hasn't gathered any scratch despite the steel wrist has okay so this one so going back to it again is um, sapphire crystal lens and also ceramic bezel it has the um, heart monitoring sensor and also it could go up to the water resistant is 5 atm i don't know what that means anyway so um let's look at the uh the way how it fits on my wrist oh actually before that look at that can you actually tell by looking at this the sideways that this is actually a smartwatch? How well and beautifully crafted. Um, one of the main concerns I have is the battery life, but if it's a day, that's, that's good enough for me. Um, and um, let's see how well it fits. Yeah, it's perfect fit for me. So um, thank you, Danny. And um, I know I'm gonna enjoy this watch for a very long time especially when I go to a business meeting with my clients. I'm sure they're gonna look at this many times. Anyway, so this is the unboxing of Tag Heuer Connected 2020. I'm gonna make more videos out of it, but if you have any queries, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.